So using Omnibus to get samples from the internet is um, it's just a very elegant, seamless way of doing it. I find it really inspiring to look on the internet, if you like, for snippets of audio. You'll find all sorts of stuff, whether it's music or dialogue, sound effects, and in theory, I mean, as it's public domain, you can use that on your tracks. So you can quite easily and quite quickly find inspiration from areas you probably wouldn't necessarily think of. He could show you if he wanted to. You tie a knot like this, and then... Omnibus just allows you to get access to those sounds straight into your door, record it in, start chopping it up, and away you go. So first of all, you want to go into your system preferences and you want to go into sound. And you want to select one of the Omnibus virtual drivers. So I'm going to select Omnibus A. So then once we've done that, we go into the setup of your door of choice. I'm using Pro Tools. You want to go into your playback engine and you want to set that to Omnibus B. So effectively, the computer i.e. things like Spotify or YouTube are using Omnibus A driver and then Pro Tools or your door is going to be using Omnibus B driver. So the next stage would be I'm going to go into uh, the Omnibus app. So here we go, this is Omnibus. So you've got your source channels on the, on the left hand side here, you've got Omnibus A and Omnibus B two different drivers and then you've got your destination channels along the top. Now with destination channels, you've, all, you've got Omnibus A and Omnibus B, but you've also got all your other outputs, if you like. So that's going to be maybe the headphone output on your computer. It's going to be the speakers on your computer. Look here, I've got my audio interface, my Fireface interface. So that's all your outputs as well. So how we set this session up now is, over here we've got Omnibus A, which is the output from our computer. And then over here we've got Omnibus B input. Now I am going to have my input tracks in Pro Tools, I've set them up as five and six. So if I come out of Omnibus A channel one and two, I literally route those to five and six. So now anything I play from YouTube will go into inputs five and six in Pro Tools. Now we've got the added complication here, which you may or may not need to do depending on what you're doing, is we're actually screen capturing this setup. So I've also got uh, a piece of software called OBS running in the background, which is set to Omnibus B, and the uh, audio from Pro Tools is coming out of outputs three and four into Omnibus B channel one and two. So what, effectively what I'm doing is I'm routing out of YouTube into Pro Tools, then out of Pro Tools into OBS. So let's go into YouTube and find some samples. You know, there's one here I like, um, which is this loop here. It says here it's royalty free, so I assume I'm, you know, safe to use it. I'm gonna go back into Pro Tools. I'm gonna arm my track. Remember I said inputs five and six is, is effectively the inputs from YouTube. So all I'm gonna do is hit record, go back into YouTube and record in and see what we got. Okay, I'm gonna get that bit, that sounds good. Great, so that's our, our hook if you like. So let's add some drums, create another track, arm it. Go into YouTube and maybe we'll type something like hip hop loop, something like that. Um, let's see what we've got. Okay, hip hop loop, 80 BPM. That sounds perfect. So let's go back into Pro Tools and hit record. Let's just grab that bit of audio. Cool, okay, so we've got like a hook, we've got a beat. Now this is where YouTube can get really interesting. Let's do an example now. Let's go into Google. And if we type in something like public domain films, here we go, Wikipedia list of public domain films. So these are films that for whatever reason was no longer in copyright. Um, and there's, there's thousands of them out there. So here's the list of films. Let's find a random one, Amazing Mr. X, whatever that is. So let's 
copy and paste Amazing Mr. X, go back into YouTube and type in Amazing Mr. X and hopefully it's there. It is there. Um, so now we've got my film. So let's put Pro Tools into record because hopefully we're going to find something soon. He's quick on his feet, I'll say that for him. How could he get out when I locked him in? He could show you if he wanted to. You tie a knot like this. And then? All right, I like that. For whatever reason, that bit of dialogue does it for me. Okay, so there's two chunks there. He could show you if he wanted to. You tie a knot like this. Two bits of audio, two bits of dialogue. Okay, so all very crude, but hopefully that gets the point across that Onibus allows you to easily get audio, get those samples and get them into your door and start playing with them and getting creative.